Lesson 5, James M. Goodhue and the Minnesota Pioneer. Originally from New Hampshire, James M. Goodhue was a lawyer and editor of the Grant County Herald in Lancaster, Wisconsin. Upon establishment of Minnesota as a territory, Goodhue immediately sold his newspaper and moved to St. Paul along with his wife, children, printing press, and two assistants. Goodhue then founded the Minnesota Pioneer, Minnesota's first newspaper. Goodhue had a broad and liberal view of public improvements, which he shared openly in his newspaper. He was proud of the city of St. Paul and had a strong desire for its success and welfare. Much of what he wrote was designed to attract new settlers to the territory, often lauding Minnesota for its natural beauty, abundant resources, fertile soil, and healthy climate. For his efforts in promoting the territory, in 1853 the territorial legislature named Goodhue County in his honor. As editor of the Pioneer, Goodhue traveled to the Traverse to Sioux in 1851 in order to report on the important treaty negotiations with the Dakota people. Goodhue's observations were printed weekly in the Minnesota Pioneer and were quite thorough, often printing verbatim accounts of speeches made during the negotiations. Goodhue, however, did not always enjoy his time at camp during the treaty negotiations. Writing on July 13, 1851, he noted, I hope the people downriver will not entertain the opinion that we are enjoying a life of extreme luxury and enjoyment, for it would be truly annoying to combat buffalo gnats and mosquitoes here amongst the Indians for a month sleeping out of doors and feeding upon rough beef and pilot bread without even the poor satisfaction of being envied.